In this video, I'm going to be mounting this scope to this AR rifle build I just recently completed. I'm going to be lapping the scope rings and showing you how I mount the optic to the rifle. So if you've ever had any questions on how this is all done, stick around and we'll go through it. The first thing to do is measure for scope ring clearance. Here I am stacking quarters on the rail section of the upper receiver. This allows me to visually gauge where the optic properly clears the rifle. The quarters will provide a rough measure of what size scope rings are needed for proper clearance. So I'm going to need roughly about a half inch of clearance from the bottom of the scope mounting surface to the very top of the rail section. I have selected Leupold High 1 inch LRW rings to mount this scope. Once we have verified adequate clearance and fit, we next bolt the bottom section of the rings to the rail. You want to make sure the rings are pushed as far forward within their rail slots as possible, so any recoil later down the road from the rifle firing will not move the optic. I am just snugging the bottom mounts up here and then I will torque both mounts to 30 foot-pounds of torque with a torque driver. Here I am doing a concentricity check with these conical alignment gauges. If the rings are perfectly concentric, then the cones should line up perfect in relation to one another. The Leupold rings aren't the worst I've ever seen, however, they are not perfect. To get the rings concentric, we will next lap the rings with a lapping rod. This is done to ensure that clamping pressure is applied evenly on the optic, so as to minimize any possible optical distortion and misalignment that can impact accuracy. Included within the scope lapping kit is lapping compound. Apply this compound to the rings at this point.
Once the lapping compound is applied, seat the lapping bar in the rings and tighten the top ring. Then begin the lapping like so. You will get to a point where the tension becomes lesser and lesser on the lapping bar. When this occurs, slightly tighten the rings a bit more and continue on lapping. Repeat this process until you have your desired results. These particular Leupold rings are serrated, so you have to remove more material than with other ring types. Here, there is a threaded drill attachment that you can chuck up in a drill to speed up the process as I am doing here. When done, the rings should have a semi-mirror finish and be smooth to the touch. You want to keep track of the front and rear sets because once lapped, they are no longer interchangeable. For proper alignment, front and rear sets have to be only mounted together. It may be helpful to mark which are front sets and which are rear. You can also re-blue the finish on the lapped ends to prevent rust and corrosion on the contact surfaces. Here I am cleaning the rings and threads out with brake cleaner to get all the grit off and out. Recheck alignment. It should be perfect, perfectly concentric. Now it's time to set eye relief. What you want to do is make sure the scope is set to its maximum magnification level. Then move the scope to where you can see through it properly in a normal shooting position. Once the scope is in a good position, I mark the rings in optic to be able to better relocate this point during the actual mounting process. In mounting the scope, I place the barrel of the rifle in a vise with cut up wooden 2x4s insulating the finish. You want to apply enough pressure to adequately clamp the rifle, but not so much that it deforms the material. I next level the rifle out with a calibrated digital level like so. You want it as perfectly level as possible. Once level, place the scope in the rings and begin leveling the optic out to parallel the scope in relation to the level surface of the top of the rifle rail. Make micro adjustments where needed 
until the two are perfectly aligned. Finish by torquing the scope rings to the manufacturer's specifications. As can be observed here, we are all leveled out. And here is the scope all mounted up. 